Hey YouTube, today um, I have a gas mask review on um, the Russian GP5 that I got in the mail today. Um, I think it's a really good gas mask as um, there's a lot of history about this thing. Um, as they're made um, in the Russian military and civilian use. I think this is a civilian model. Um, I think military ones were black or gray. Um, it's made of... Yeah, I think it was made um, during, I mean, after the time of World War II, when um, Russia and America was stepping up their military needs, and um, such as weapons, nuclear stuff, um, biological stuff, and um, okay, let's get to the like things, like the specs of it. Um, it's made of like rubber, stretchy rubber. Um, has glass eye rings, eye pieces, um, I don't know what, I think this is just aluminum painted, um, the filter, it's, um, just green, I think this expired in 1997, I mean 1977, it is Russian, has the Russian acrylic on it, and, um, it is sealed, I got it on Amazon for 12 bucks. And here's the gas mask bag, the carrying bag that it came with. This is, I think, the original one that it would have came with, as it, um, I'm pretty sure it has, um, Russian acrylic on it. Yeah, it does. And, um, I'm gonna put the mask on right now, but, um, I'm not gonna take the time to unscrew the filter and stuff. And so, here we go. It's a nice mask, um, I'm not sure if you can hear me really good out of it, because, um, I'm pretty sure the voice box or whatever it is that it has isn't that great, but, um, it's comfortable, it doesn't hurt or anything, you can hear pretty good out of it, um, it's a lot easier, e easier talking out of it than, um, some other gas masks, um, it sort of fogs up. When you exhale throughout your mouth, so you want to breathe in through your nose and exhale through your nose, um, the air goes in from here, goes through the filter first, then goes from here, then follows up these, and it helps defog the lenses too, as the air like pushes up against this, then goes into your nose or mouth, and um, yeah, it's comfortable, it's nice. And um, I'm going to take this off and talk about the filter. It gives you quite staticky hair. Um, yeah, the filter, people say it has asbestos in it, but, but it doesn't. Because after 1950, they stopped um, making filters with asbestos as they realized it was really bad for you and for your lungs. And it would lead to bad things like mesothelioma, whatever it is. Yeah, the filter comes with another seal thing that just plugs in goes inside the cap keep for a better seal yeah this thing has been expired for quite some time has a rubber plug at the bottom it's kind of tricky to get out not really but and um there's the filter yeah they don't use asbestos in the filters they use activated charcoal it's just basically like charcoal powder something like that um, I'm not really sure what about it and it has some quite a bit of screening and, um, that's basically all I have for this, um, review. Hope you enjoyed the video. Comment, rate, subscribe.